Greetings, this is Edward Ojongo. You can estimate the reading time by calculating the words per minute using PHP. Fiction, scientific, technical content types can affect the words per minute. The ability and knowledge of the reader can also affect the estimate. Assume that children and seniors will have a lower estimate than recent college graduates. PHP was used to create the online version of learning PHP. In this tutorial, we will create a simple estimator for reading words per minute. To follow along, you will need PHP and an optional text editor to create code. Let's get started. First, we'll create a folder for our application. Then, we'll, we'll create the estimate underscore reading PHP file. I'll use nano. But you can use any editor you want. So the paragraph is simply anything we want. Just to save some time here, I'm going to simply just copy paste Next, we want to calculate the number of words. So we use a PHP built-in function called string word count. Then next we will use the we will base our words per minute on fiction and I'll say 200 this is for recent college graduates obviously if your target uh, audience is young kids you set it lower or the seniors a little bit lower now obviously if it's for say if you have a scientific uh, content you can set it higher because you expect them to read oh if it's difficult you can obviously set it lower it's all up to you so we divide the number of words by the words per minute Then all we have to do is echo And we're done here. So I'm going to save. And then we can run our online three. Okay, let's edit that.
So the issue is I forgot to put a semicolon on the first line. Okay, now if we run it, you see it will take 0 0.45 to read par the paragraph. As a bonus, I am going to I am going to also make uh, another one that you can also use another version with an actual practical application. To demonstrate what you can do once you learn, once you're comfortable with PHP. So, so what we need to do is we need to make sure that we don't trust user input. This is exactly the same from before, so I'll just copy So the number of words is the same as the, uh, the other one. So I can make this a little bit bigger so you can see it. Okay, then what we need is the output. And now we we'll just get some HTML. So this is the HTML doc type. The HTML tag head is uh, UTF-8 for the character set. It's just a title. And that's a head section in the body. Just have a form tag, and we're going to use the text area, the name of paragraph, and we have a button. So when you click the button, you will be able to calculate. That's what we did up here to calculate the uh, words per minute. So this should be okay. And we're going to close up our PHP here. So then what will happen is the PHP is used two places. Here is for the paragraph and here is for the output. So once this is done, we simply make sure this is saved. Okay, here, 
then what we want to do is we want to start a, a local host uh, we're going to use the built-in PHP editor uh, as web server Okay, then if I type okay. so it takes zero seconds. I type uh, a longer paragraph. Okay, zero, so there's something wrong. Let's type. So it's telling us there's something online, something wrong on line four. Okay, so there's a mistake here. And there's another mistake. I spelled paragraph wrong. Now, if I go and then you can also obviously go and type in as long as the you need. Find the full article including code snippets and commands at ojumbo.com slash php hyphen estimate hyphen reading hyphen words hyphen word hyphen per hyphen minute. If you want to learn PHP online in a web browser, then visit ojumboshop.com slash learning hyphen php. If you need help building websites or for app development or programming tutorials including PHP one-on-one, -on -one, then visit ojamboservices.com. You can go to the contact page by simply clicking contact here and then just fill out the information and you'll get a free no-obligation code. Thank you. Have a nice day.